How's it going, everybody? This is 42% health. Back into Skyrim. Um, I don't remember exactly where we left off. We were somewhere in the Dawn Guard. Iron Steel. So we got a whole... Oh, yeah. Wow. Okay, so... Um, Serana's dad is messed up in the head. He found, like, a part of a prophecy, it's an incomplete prophecy, apparently, uh, that says something about vampires no longer needing to fear the sun. Uh, he seems to think that he has a way of, he knows some way of putting the sun out or something so that vampires can uh, roam the earth all 24 hours of the day, if you can call it day. <clears throat> and, uh... We're trying to stop him. Yes. What did you mean? And she said that about four times. You're supposed to be telling me where this secret entrance is. I don't trust you not to come alive. <laughs> she followed me up here. That's pretty good. Oh, this is so amazing. The amount of detail they put in this game. Something else. Okay. The compass in my eyeball is telling me to go this way, because this is where the secret entrance is. I don't really want to jump that far down. I have no death wish. Okay, this looks promising. Apparently skeletons. Whoa, whoa, what is that arrow? Critical strike, and it's still not dead, so I take it it's just an extra damage strike. Jeez. Oh, these are four sworn arrows, and I only got two left. Didn't I decide that these arrows were lame? Damage eight. Where is the four sworn arrow? I don't know, but... <laughs> 
Jeez. I am failing the R3 today. What am I hearing, like, right here? You! Ha-cha! Right between the eyes. Alright. Uh, Serana got lost somehow. Oh, that guy. You know what? I'm just coming up after you. Or, uh, I thought I was. Here we go. There's a secret entrance. You know what? I don't even care. Unless this guy has like 300 gold on him. I couldn't care less about. Uh, let's go ahead and search this guy. Serana got stuck somewhere. Alrighty, here we go. Volkahar Undercroft. We don't need a sneak. Yes. What did you need? Wow. It's just new dialogue. Before. My parents almost never let me off the island, so yeah, I poked around town here a lot. It was a little quieter back then. This little vampire girl was enough to scare off the rats. <laughs> uh I was, but I think I turned out okay. Uh other than being a vampire, of course. I can't wait to see the courtyard again. Where did you come from? <laughs> right I missed what she said. Um, I think I saw another dialogue option that I yeah. What did you need? You talk about being lonely a lot. Well, growing up the way I did, you get used to it. Okay. No, they didn't. That's why I like being out here with you. But what about you? What about me? Do you get lonely? Are there people in your life? Um, that's probably Does it bother you that I'm here. No, me too. Anyway, this is all very touching, but don't we have some more important things to worry about right now? Yeah, sure. Let's go. Vampires eat cabbage? Oh. The old water system. On some
some days this would smell just You'd be glad you were. Who's there? You know I heard something. All the death hounds. Get him! Done and done. <clears throat> Oops, I didn't want that. I want the gold. Yes. What did you need? Nothing. I'm poking around, stealing stuff from your dad. Is that okay? That was trapped, yes. and somehow I avoided the trap. Nothing. Just let me take my time. You're going to come alive, aren't you? You? I guess you did. Who's there? Where'd you go? Where did that vampire lady go? Oh, wow, she did run. She ran far. Journal fragment, that might be interesting. Ring. Uh, yeah, I'll take a 100 to 1 carry to, or value to weight ratio. Use that thing on me, see if I flee. You tried resurrecting a thing again, didn't you? You tried resurrecting a skeever? Art thou serious? Vampire gauntlets. Leather. Yes? What did you need? Nothing. I need you to shut your mouth for a while. Uh, I should keep that. It's valuable. I'm just taking all of your dad's stuff. Oh, nice. I hear... Okay. Bye. Serana, I was going to search this guy. And he has nothing. Uh, so what did she say? I think she said go left. And I went right. Which is very typical of me, even in real life. Uh, these don't look...
Don't touch the thingies. They hurt. I can't tell what she's saying. Something right there. Serana, you're a little weird. I'm, uh, I'm actually kind of excited to do a mage playthrough of this game now. Because there's some interesting spells. Yes. What did you need? I need you to stop asking that question. Poor dog. Oh boy. Well, if Lydia was here, she would say she has a bad feeling about this. I'm going to hit F5. See, I'm pressing the shout button and nothing's happening now. There he goes. Who's there? Yay, the dog came in handy. Oh, there we go. So what's this way? Oh, chest. Oh, so close. Just a little bit this way. Orichalcum? Orichalcum or Orichalcum? There's probably a debate as to how it's pronounced. If I know gaming communities, which I don't. Runt books. Don't touch the pokey things. Good girl. And we go this way. This leads out to the courtyard. Just head to the door. Okay, got it. You've made it to the courtyard. You don't say. What's the matter? It's not supposed to look like this. I would have thought maybe vampires like their courtyards to be full of dead trees and stuff. What happened to this place? Everything's been torn down. Looks like a vampire got to it. Well, it's dead. Yeah. You're the first to set foot here in centuries. Could be. Oops, did not mean to fall off. Gotta fix the railing. Somebody who's not dragonborn might get hurt falling off of there. Um. Hang on a sec. I just remembered something. We picked up a note or something. Journal fragment. Not good enough to live in their stupid keep, am I? Stupid sods don't realize I've moved into the undercrop and started taking control of their own death hounds. I'll get my revenge. Oh, okay. Oh, great. Place missing crest. That must be New Moon, then. Uh, 
Um, so we're supposed to find missing crests. Investigate the moon dial. That's all it says. I'm investigating it. I'm telling you, there's something strange with the moon dial. Okay, I believe you. Nightshade. Don't eat that. We can go in the castle from here. Oh, here's one. North Tower. Are they all just going to be scattered around here? I'm only seeing the one. I probably have to go in the castle for the rest of them. How many are missing? How many are we looking for here? I'm going to presume... Yep, that one goes there. So this is a new moon. It doesn't need one. I'm telling you, there's something strange with the moon dial. I believe you. So there's one, two... There's two more, but it looks like there's two new moons or something. Only two more. Here's one. There we go. Just like Hexen. Except Hexen couldn't do that. Okay. This is getting spooky though. I mean, like... This isn't anywhere your dad would just be, like, watching TV or something, right? Walk right into your living room. Or his living room. That's your living room, too. We're getting close. Sure. I've never even seen this place like that before. Be careful. I don't know what might be around. I'm being careful. Uh, sure. This isn't sketchy. Man, Serana's got like some powerful magics there. You guys don't have any gold. 
Some of them don't even have bone meal in their bones. We're getting close. I'm sure. I already searched you, okay. Uh Quest is on this side, so let's go join let's go poke around the other side first. Nada. Nothing. Okay. Fair enough. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm gonna have to get myself a drink of water after this episode. After this video. <gasps> right. Done and done. Oh man, I love those enemies. Those guys are all right. Is that what's seeing me? No. Who's there? Heh, <laughs> she said it again. I still missed it. She has like some of the most interesting dialogue in the game so far. Like everyone else, you kind of just imagine that somebody wrote a story about them. I mean, somebody wrote a story about her too, but... Malachite ore. Must be on the other side of the wall. Oh, there's a bunch of them coming for us. Sure, why not? Oh. Who's there? Oh, these are chests? I wonder how many of these I've missed. Okay, hang on. There was a door to unlock back here. Oh, let's see. Aedra and Deidra. There's a door back here I wanted to unlock. Perfect. Cool. All right.
Serana, you are weird. Man, she is Johnny on the spot with that ice. Like, I thought I killed that thing pretty quick, but it's already got ice through its rib cage. Another gargoyle. Bring it! Bring it! Yes! <laughs> I still jumped a little, even though I expected it. What is he saying? Okay. We activated the pull chain. What did it do? Open the door? Maybe? Maybe. Who's shooting? Probably been here the whole time. Done and done. Expert, huh? Uh, I should also be saving at some point. Let's try this. Oh boy. Perfect. Yay, I leveled up. It's getting to be more rare. Take it you need to bump up more skills as you get more leveled. The levels come slower. Hunting Bow of Frost. Sure, why not? Any other cool junk here? Orcish Battle Axe of Weariness. Sure. Skeletons. There. Oop. <laughs> I meant to search the skeleton, but I hard, I'm having a hard time telling the difference between the two skeletons. Gal, you're about as amazing as Lydia, and that's saying something. We're getting close, I'm sure. Yeah, you keep saying that. So now what? Do we need to cross that bridge? You said that. Come on, I saw the message. There.
Serana, your skeleton. We need to talk about this resurrecting junk. It keeps making me think there are enemies nearby. I don't even want to know. Bloody rags. Why? Why would I want those? Is that a troll? Yeah, that's a troll skull. Huh. Interesting. How long have I been recording? 36 minutes. We're good for a while yet. Gargoyles, they're coming to life. Okay, I am taking too much of a beating. Serana resurrected gargoyle already. Thank you. That was kind of close. Ah! <laughs> Is this an epic kill or not? Okay. Nice work. These are full of all the good sto all the good ore. But there's some kind of secret passage around here. Vampire royal armor. Man. Silver sword. Should we sleep in a coffin? Sure. Okay, I believe you. Oh wait. When I when I saw the message there, turn candlestick, I thought it was like the torches before where you could take the candles. So then I thought turn seemed like a weird verb. You following? Alright, uh this looks like it. Something something's gonna go down here. Holy crap. Three hundred? Soul gem shards added. Uh, that was a quest item, I think. Fire salts. Wow, those are expensive. Void salts. Those are even more expensive. Purified void salts. Wow, okay. Can we disenchant anything? Frost. Sure. Sparks, sure. Sure. Sure.
That's like a hundred and something to one ratio. Let's take a look around. There has to be something here that tells us where she's gone. What are we looking for? My mother was meticulous about her research. If we can find her notes, there might be some hints in there. I had no idea her laboratory even existed. She had an alchemy set up in her drawing room, but nothing that even comes close to what's here. Hmm. What did she research? Looking at the equipment and materials, it looks like she was trying to advance her necromancy. I don't know. Certainly not longevity. Kind of a waste of time for a vampire. Okay. <laughs> not that I ever saw. My mother had a bit of a thing for magical constructs. Not... not what you're thinking. She just found them fascinating. Um... what am I thinking? Or... I remember she used to keep a small journal. Do I not want to ask that? Uh, that's probably a quest item. Uh, look for her journal. Sorry guys, I'm a kind of a slow reader, so I can't just... Oh boy. Oh, found it. Let's see if there's any good uh, expensive skill books here. Don't see them. Alright. Yeah. That's outside. You did? Let me see them. Here you go. I only know what she told me. She had a theory about soul gems. That the souls inside of them don't just vanish when they're used. They end up in the soul cup. Soul gems have souls inside of them. Why should I be surprised, I guess? The soul cairn is home to very powerful beings. Necromancers send them souls and receive powers of their own in return. My mother spent a lot of time trying to contact them directly, to travel to the soul cairn itself. Oh. Oh. So maybe she's disembodied or something, and that's how she's hiding. Her soul is somewhere else. That circle in the center of the room is definitely some type of portal. If I'm reading this right... There's a formula here that should give us safe passage into the soul cairn. Um, what do we need? A handful of soul gem shards, some finely ground bone meal, a good bit of purified void salts. Haha, <laughs> okay. Damn it. Oh, uh, now what? We're also going to need a sample of her blood, which, if we could get that, we wouldn't even be trying to do this in the first place. You share her blood? Hmm, not bad. We better hope that's good enough. Mistakes with these kind of portals can be gruesome. Ooh. Okay, enough of that. Let's get started. Oh, I've already got all the ingredients. Well then, let's head over to the portal vessel and I'll do the rest. Okay. Well, that was easy. Ooh, chests. Where are you? Oh, okay. Get the ingredients in that vessel and let me know when you're ready. Done. Then the rest is up to me. Are you ready to go? I'm not entirely sure what this thing is going to do when I add my blood. What do I want to ask her? Of course. 
What is it? What will you do if we find your mother? I've myself the same thing since we came back to the castle. She was so sure of what we did to my father. I couldn't help but go along with her. What did you do to I him? Out of the cost. Neither do I. She always seemed happy before we heard the prophecy. Then it all changed. She became a different person. They both did. Yes, you're right. I'm sorry. I just didn't expect anyone to care how I felt about her. Thank you. Are we ready then? No prob, sure. Let's go. Alright, here goes. Alright, so good grief. What in the world is a soul cairn? Okay, that's pretty wicked. Ready? Here we go. Uh oh. I, it, yeah, it kind of was. Oh, thanks. Um there might be, but I don't think you're going to like it. Vampires aren't counted among the living. I could probably go through there without a problem. I need to become a vampire? Not your first choice, I guess. Uh maybe. We could just pay the toll another way. It wants a soul, so we give it a soul. Yours. Wouldn't that kill me? My mother taught me a trick or two. I could partially soul track you and offer that gem to the ideal masters. It might be enough to satisfy them. It would make you a bit weaker when you travel through the soul cairn, but we might be able to fix that once we're inside. Maybe. Are those my only options? I'm sorry. I wish I knew a better way, something that would be easier for you. Just know that whatever path you choose, I won't think any less of you. Sometimes things just have to be done. I know that better than anybody. Become a vampire or become partially soul trapped. Um well we know how to cure ourselves from being a vampire. The soul trap is probably temporary too. Have you made up your mind? Give me a sec. The soul trap is probably or intentionally weaken me while I roam the soul cairn. So when I get back, hopefully I'll be better, I think. Um, I will also lose my werewolf status, which I really don't care that much about. I don't seem to be any stronger as a werewolf than otherwise. I can't roam around towns as a werewolf. And... Uh, I don't know how to cure myself of werewolfness, so maybe I'll become a vampire. And then just do cure disease when I'm done. Sure. Are you sure? I'm willing to turn you, but you need to think it through. You've become the very thing you've sworn to destroy. I don't know how the Dawn God will react. It's okay, I'll cure myself. Turning someone is a very personal thing for vampires. It's intimate for us. Uh oh. I feel like I'm forcing you into this. <laughs> uh. Good. I promise to try and make this as painless as possible. Let's do it. Chomp. Okay. I done got bit. I'm a vampire. Um, okay. Hang on. What time are we got? We got 50 minutes. So, I'm going to call it a video right here. And I will pick up in just a sec. So, thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now.